All right, hello football gamers. Welcome back to Madden Football Gaming. So super excited to bring you this tip. So got some questions on how to get fumbles and uh, uh, as quickly as possible. While well, I have that tip, I'm gonna show you how to get fumbles as quickly as possible, but also tackles and sacks. As you can see, my fumbles, I got completed. It took me about 30 minutes using this method and I got 50 fumbles. Um, also, have a whole bunch of solo tackles and have a whole bunch of sacks uh, using this method. So I'm actually gonna stay with this method. I'm just not going to uh, hit stick to not get the fumbles uh, and just get the quick sacks and the tackles because I don't need the fumbles and it'll just elongate the game and I can actually get this quicker if they don't fumble it. So anyways, let me show you what I mean. Super excited to bring this tip. If this does help you out, please do like and subscribe. I'll bring more content like this in the future, of course, uh, but it helps me out a lot, so thank you. Um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to challenges and you're going to go to the campaign. So right here. And then you're going to go to week six, and then you're going to go to aggressive tackles right here. So the requirements are tackle the ball carrier three times. All right, so the formation that you're going to want to use is goal line, and you're going to want a 60 base. So that's what you're going to want to use. I like to spread my line, um, and then you're going to use or whatever middle linebacker they have. They almost always switch the play when they see you in this to something different. Uh, they did this time. Um, but what you're going to do is you get tackles, which is great, but when they go to a passing play, which they usually do almost every single time, your people off the right side are going to come in and, uh, um, free on this quarterback, like right here. And all you do is do a hit stick, you get the ball, um, and there's your fumble. You also get a sack and you also get a tackle. So you get three for one. Play game, goal line, 60 base, going to spread the line, going to uh, use the guy on the running back, and we're going to get in here and we're going to uh, get a pick. All right, we're going to get a pick six. So there's some points and um, there's an interception, all the stuff you need for Cam Chancellor anyways, uh, but, and we didn't even have to worry about a tackle, so... Um, we still get to play this challenge without having to restart it and um, all going swimmingly. All right, 60 base, spread the line. If they do a spread formation like this, sometimes they still audible out of it too, but if they don't, um, then you can just use one of the people on the, in the middle. There we go, fumble baby. Picked it up, run it in for a touchdown. That's a sack, that's a tackle. That is a fumble, and that is points. The quad for Superman right there, uh, Bradley Chubb. Anyways, um, that is exactly what I'm talking about. So uh, every single time I complete this challenge, I get a sack, I get a tackle, I get a fumble. Actually, you have to get three tackles to, to complete it, but I usually get um, two to three uh, sacks. I usually get one to two fumbles. Um, and complete this every single time. Sometimes I get a bonus, which is a little bit of that um, fumble recovery for a touchdown or something like that, but it all go goes towards Cam Chancellor. So this is what I was talking about as far as win 50 games within uh, overall. So you have this win 20 games with um, something that's uh, 70 or less, win 40 games in overall of 80 or less. Those all go together. So you can just you know, the, the 20 games you win and the 70 overall or less, that goes into the 80. And then I'm at this uh, 83, and I've already completed 50 games in ab about 40 minutes um, doing this challenge with that because I literally got an 83 right before I, I found this challenge. Um, and then for earned stats and complete dailies, I have now all my fumbles complete. I'm now 63% for uh, tackles, 39% uh, for sacks. Um, again, just doing this uh, challenge for about 40 minutes over and over and over and over and over again. Um, I've also made some additional um, ground here in these uh, total points, uh, in the intercept passes, um, etc. So uh, if you get a fumble recovery for a touchdown, um, if for some reason you get a fumble recovery, don't get in the end zone, you can just go ahead and, and throw a... Um, uh, throw a touchdown. It goes right here. It also goes into these passing yards, and it also goes into these total points. So that's not wasted time. Everything in this challenge is super, super efficient, and you can just do it over and over and over and over again. It is the quickest way to get 
50 forced fumbles. It is the quickest way to get 100 solo tackles and to record 200 sacks out of everything that I've seen. Plus, it'll also go into this. Um, plus, it'll also go into your uh, winning overall games. So you want to level up your uh, cam chancer super, super quickly. Do this challenge uh, until you're done with your tackles, done with your sacks, done with your fumbles. Um, and then all these that you can get completed right here for the winning games um, are probably going to be complete as far as up to the... Um, uh, to the level that you're currently at. I'm not an 87, so that won't be complete, but this one will be. Um, and then that's when you're going to switch the solo. And I'll bring you another solo, the next one to do. But that's when you're going to switch your solo to passing yards and total points and passing TDs. Um, so you have to get 800 passing TDs, you have to get 500 total points, and you have to get 80,000 passing yards. Um, if you didn't want to do that, if that seems like too long for you, instead you could do the switch it to um, rushing yards, total points, um, and um, where's the rushing TDs? Oh, there, yeah, yeah. Sorry, there's the rushing TDs, there's the rushing yards, and then the uh, uh, total points. So if that one's easier for you, you can do that. But those are the two different challenges. So this challenge is going to do... The, these these three right here. Another challenge is going to do the TDs, the points, and uh, the passing yards. And then one other challenge I'm going to show you is going to do the rushing TDs, um, the rushing yards, and also increase this points. And then you'll have pretty much everything complete um, except for the, the 25 daily objectives, which you just got to do every single day. So it's going to take you 25 days at least. Um, and the intercept passes... Um, but you're going to be pretty close to that uh, intercept 100 pass. I'm already at 27%, um, and I really haven't done anything or even focused on it. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really was excited to bring you how to go ahead and upgrade Cam Chancer super quickly, how to get those fumbles, tackles, and sacks the quickest way possible in the same challenge while also completing overall winning games. So uh, anyways, I hope this helped you out. If it did, please like and subscribe. It helps me out so much. Uh, and as always, thank you so much for watching.